Pittsburgh Penguins. It still sounds strange to say that. Yeah. You're such a natural predator yeah. in, in my eyes. And you played for Barry Trotz for a lot of years. You played in a very rigid discipline system. How much does that help you as a player instinctively in your own end? I think obviously the West compared to the East is the West is a little more defensively and, and which yes. is funny because not everybody thinks of it that way uh, but it is uh -huh. like everybody it's a little more detail like mm -hmm. around the lines and all that so I think it's just in the back of my mind every time like if there's a bell down in our end like I have to make sure the puck goes out but here maybe they try to find the middle and, and we didn't really we worked on that but that I think that happened more in, in the East so you have to get used to that a little bit and, and and maybe sometimes don't pinch that hard in the East too, so it's a little bit of a change, but you know what, I, I play against the East a lot of times too, so it's just a little, little thing you need to change, and, and um, I think it'd be fun to play here though. Now I was going to say, fun is one word that people use. Yeah. I mean, you come to a team like Pittsburgh that's been known for three decades, yeah. really, for offense. Yeah, that's right. Does it change anything at all about your mindset or your game, or do you just say, I, I have to be who I am? It's changed a little bit. You need, you need to make a little more plays out there for sure. Like you need to, at least if you play with Crossbow Malkin, Malkin, you have to make sure you get the puck in their hand early, so they can come up with speed. And, and obviously, I didn't play with any of those kind of guys in Nashville, so that's a little change. But everything else is the same. I gotta work hard and go hard to the net and battle down low. And I not I not gonna change my game that much. I was gonna say mostly you were talking about on the rush. You're not yeah. gonna just chip it in. No, exactly. When you have, when you have Sidney Crosby open no, or exactly. Kenny Malkin open. Oh, even if there's any mm -hmm. guy in Nashville open, I try to give it to them. But here you might you might have to go through those sticks or skates or f to make sure they they get the puck because they can do something about nothing up there. They so so be good. fun too because every forward is a it wants to be a scorer. And, yeah, for sure. Yeah. I mean, there's no you know what I mean? Yeah. So if I get a chance to play with either of those two guys, just have to try to get open. Patrick, I'm fascinated by the concept of players who become good at going to the net over time. Because they tell you whether it's Thomas Holmstrom, whether whoever it is, that you have to almost be born there. And you have to you have to be born to love being at the net and scoring goals there. How did you get to that point? It started in Nashville. I, I was um, obviously when I was younger. I always play up in the in the slot area for for one timers so, or high tips or and all that. But then in Nashville, we have so many good players, so it didn't really fit me. I didn't have a chance to play there on the power play, so they put me in front. And since the, that, why did Barry do that? What I don't was know. Just thinking. I mean, you're not a, you're not a huge no, guy. but I always like to go go to to the net, like mm -hmm. even on the rush and all that. I always go pretty hard to the net, and and so they try me there. And since then, I've been I've been there, and I love it. It's it's the best part of the game where you got a power play. You know, you're gonna stand there for face the shots and then try to get the rebounds and all that. So just like you said, you you need to be. Not born that way, but you need to have the right mindset to go there. And you know, it's, you're gonna get hurt or hit once in a while, but yes, battle and then uh, try to pick up those loose, loose pups. Last question for you: You just strike me from just watching you around here since you've been here, like a guy who just likes to have fun. You're not yeah, gonna, I mean, it's for sure. You, you know, where, where does that come from? No, I think that's I'm <laughs> I'm that kind of guy. I just love to be at the rink and I love to to be on the ice and then. Um, yeah, this is the, the best part of my life, to play hockey and uh, why not have fun when you're here.